they say something like all your clothes from sweatshops and their savior is your labor, uh, social handcuff enslavement. That was like powerful. And then something about when the phone is in your pocket only, only had a few games. So basically I think they're referring to like when we were kids back then, when they were kids, they only had a few games and look at all the advancement, all the, you know, that you could do this fast and this and that, but at the expense of what? You know, our humanity? It's showtime, folks. Hey, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Into the Music. That smiling guy is Andy. Andy, how you doing? I do well, sir. How you doing? I'm doing well. My name is Greg, and people are like, oh, I see your name right there. So why are you telling me? I'm sorry. Um, Zoom just recently started putting our names on you. I don't, I, right? I don't think that was always the case. But anyway, and I forgot to actually change my name to the big, to the big Kahuna. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your government name, right? Yeah. Yeah. So uh, enough of this silliness, right? Um, you got a song for me. That's the rumor. Tis the rumor, and the rumor is proven true. Um, I want you to give a listen to a band called <laughs> The Snuts. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. No idea. And the song is called Zucker Punch. It's not, you're not like having a stroke and then you meant to say The Smuts, right? And you said The Snuts. <laughs> it's really the there are a lot, of, a lot of risque words that it sounds like, but I, it's pretty sure it's just The Snuts. So yeah. S yeah. And, and as in Nancy, and as a yeah. nut. It's nuts. Yep. Okay, cool. Uh, and what's it called? Punch? What punch? Z Zucker punch. Zucker punch. Okay. All right. Yeah. It'll make sense once you start hearing it. Okay, cool. Um, I will come back. Sounds good. Oh, the Amazonian shopping for the masses in your cassette. You need to live some more plastic in your life, bro. Is that right? No. All your clothes are from sweatshops, and their savior is your labor. Social handcuff and slavers. Your search history stole mystery, rim shot, kick, clap, hole. From the South Beach and the cold East, the Middle East and Rome. It's tweet this, snap that, all the things that make you go. A sucker punch and a cold ass lunch don't speak to you being so to walk with me down memory lane. When the phone in your pocket only had a few games. No, is this click bring my new safe space sit back and do what y'all so to walk with me down memory lane when the phone in your pocket only had a few games one stay two stay now it's your brain throw me the keys to your cuffs and then i'll be on my way like that are you willing to change your business model in the interest of protecting individual privacy Congresswoman, I'm not sure what that means. Oh, that's it? Ah. Wants me to watch it again, listen to it again. Hmm. Tempting. <laughs> Just writing a couple notes here. Wow. Okay. 
Wow, I think a lot to unpack in such a, for such a short song. Yeah, let's go to Dandy on this one, of course. Hey, I have no choice. Look at the cat dragged in. It's the big deal. <laughs> I got a cat here. <laughs> God damn it! Damn it. <laughs> Told my wife I'm not leaving that cat in all the time. <laughs> oh man! So, um, the snuts and Zucker Punch um, gave it a listen. What do you think? Too short. Yeah, it was a short. It's too short because it really is, um, and it's so interesting lyrically what they're talking about. And you know, usually, usually. I'm really getting into the music and at the expense of the lyrics. Well, this time it was more, even though I, I can't tell you all the lyrics, even though it's a lyric video you gave me, but I wrote some stuff down. But even like that first lyric sort of page thing, that was so interesting. And then because it's so short, and then there was, I don't know, I'm bouncing around. But again, the lyrics first and the message. And what, what I got out of this was, that they're talking about advancement in technology, right? That look how far we've come in technology and communicating and messaging, um, but not even that. Also, like just technology, the fact that you know people can do work faster and stuff like that, um, and it goes right down the whole line. Uh, they say something like, "All your clothes from sweatshops, and their savior is your labor." Um, social handcuff enslavement. That was like powerful. And then something about when the phone is in your pocket, only only had a few games. So basically, I think they're referring to like when we were kids back then, when they were kids, they only had a few games. And look at all the investment, all the, you know, that you could do this fast and this and that. But at the expense of what? You know, our humanity, you know? So it was it was that, that if I'm not like way off, that was fascinating to me as the music is going on. And then all of a sudden, because it's a kind of a heavily produced song, you know, there's a lot of sounds and stuff going on. And then there was this freaking wah-wah. And you know, you got to know, right? That, you know, when it, when it's a, I'm like Tom Joe with the wah-wah, whatever it is, a wah-wah, I'm there. You know, I'm like, I, I'm there, I'm there. And it was good. It was produced. And it was like a little muffled kind of thing, but it was good. It was good. So the whole, so musically, and um, and what it was saying, I think, yeah, I'm definitely in. And I have to go back now and just like and 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 watch and listen to the whole thing again. Yeah. And and uh, but then then but then again, you're gonna tell me if I'm right or wrong about the message. So what do you think? Oh, uh, I think you're, the message is spot on. Um, and I think the the name of the tune is sort of an illusion. <laughs> yeah, go you ahead. said I would get it. Yeah. I don't. I don't. I don't get the Zucker punch thing. You know, okay. except that you know. So if I'm right on the message, then what am I missing about the name? I think the Zucker punch is sort of the allusion to Mark Zuckerberg, who is like the face of a lot of this stuff that we deal with day to day, right? Like Mark Facebook, IG. Um, so yeah, the line is a Zucker punch and a cold ass lunch. Don't speak to you've been told. Is sort of the yeah. hook that, that keeps bringing it back to Zucker punch. Um, and yeah, like this is all about the way we, we've talked about this before in other tunes, somewhat modern tunes kind of talk about this too. This whole idea, the advent of the internet and how much of a monster it's become and how we use it and how it's being monitored and um, the, the, the comforts that it brings. But, it, but like you said, at what cost? Um, you know, it's pretty unse- unseemly. And you alluded it to with it with the whole sweatshop, you know, discuss like allusion yeah. in, in the lyrics, you know, robotic, hypnotic, Amazonian shopping for the masses in your cachet yeah. Yeah. says need a little more plastic. Like again, that and that reminds me of what we've talked about with Parquet Courts um, and, and the tune we covered from them, where it's like this is like this digs deep at a societal issue right now and sort of this juncture we're at. Um comfort over conscious and how do we you know navigate that and strike the right balance um because yeah business dealings and and the way our iphones are made and the way our nikes are made and all this stuff is pretty pretty gross and i think these guys do a nice tongue-in-cheek way of, of attacking it um i think one of my favorite lines from the song is your search history is no mystery Rimshot clap hold. 
um like it's like a you know like it like it's a joke like your yeah. your search history is no mystery um but he right. says the words for it you know and yeah it's just very clever from the south beach to the cold east the middle east and rome it's tweet this snap that all the things that make you go hmm. uh it's just you know it's becoming a worldwide yeah. kind of uh digital epidemic you know we just got through or getting through uh i should say one on a on a biological level but we're also dealing with one um on a societal level that's influenced from this new like digital paradigm that we're all navigating and learning about in real time and it's scary and mysterious and there's this new frontier aspect to it all i just thought it was really clever spoke to me kind of spoke to the way i look at it my yeah. fears about it so so thought I'd see what what the big kahuna thought about the, this, <laughs> this this uh, sort of social commentary well, in the know, form to, of a tune. To be honest, out there, Andy and I just reacted to in, in the same session. We just did "Window Seat" from Erica Bedu, and um, I don't know. I see a connection with that. Like you know, that the main point of that song was groupthink. You know, and how we get lost in ourselves that you know where's our individuals and where's our you know ability to kind of step outside the group and think for ourselves and i think that when you the whole facebook social media aspect of this um this song here the message yeah you know when i think about zucker zucker punch um yeah you know and that term um, a cold ass lunch you know what i mean like yeah. lunch is free that whole trope and you know it's just and like what i said early, earlier about like at you know at at what expense, you know, and to me, um, there's, you know, to me, there's big time damage being done to our society uh, when it comes to um, like, you know, are we really allowed to really think for ourselves? You know, mm -hmm. we just seem to be grouped into these things. And I think Facebook and Twitter definitely encourages that, you know, it's, it's, it's the jumping in platform, you know, yeah, it's an to echo jump chamber. off and like be part of this group, you know, and, yeah. and then if, if you, if someone has ideas that maybe that go against that group think, you know, then you get attacked and you get canceled and like that. I mean, we're in this stage, yeah. you know, and to me, this is putting aside political, you know, where you stand. You Both know, sides are guilty you of can't finding have, safe spaces and stuff. Yeah. I mean, even the situation that we're facing right now with, um, the Texas school shooting uh, that happened just a several a few days ago, and um, we got it. We got to come to both sides, all sides, whatever sides, have to come together and figure out a solution to get guns out of people, you know, people's hands who should not have guns. Um, and so I know I'm going down a path here, and and but it's just, you know, this to me is all part of it. It's it's what do we do to ourselves, to society? You know, it's technology technology you know um, we're using it's it driving a lot yeah a lot of bad stuff you know and then the amazon thing that you you brought in you know um yeah it's clever how they jumped on the whole facebook thing and the angle and zucker you know how mm -hmm. about bezos yeah how about and he doesn't he doesn't go by unscathed in this right because right out of the gate it's that amazonian shopping right that he talks about. so this song could have been renamed bezosis like yeah gnosis yes. bezosis yeah. Mm -hmm. absolutely nah, i think it sounds yeah. better sucker punch sucker punch <laughs> but um wait wait before i go before i go the vocals i wrote down sound so familiar they were good i liked them yeah. but the voice is so familiar is this a guy that's like i should know no in fact these are a group of pretty young dudes they're um they formed in 2015 this track came out this year in 2022 um and they're from scotland um, and I don't think they've got a lot of traction here in the States, but I stumbled upon them, saw an interesting article or something labeled, are the Snuts the UK's next greatest band since the Arctic Monkeys? And I was like, oh, wow. now I'm looking up the Snuts. <laughs> so I <laughs> fell, into, fell into a rabbit hole and, and I loved a bunch of their tunes. This one was so biting and quick and a, a nice quick taste of yeah. what they can do. They're, some of their other stuff, much more like guitar driven and not as producing and electronic but this one fits the vibe of the tune but there's some other ones that have a little bit of a different sound but the guy's voice is great in all of them it really is yeah that's cool that's cool you yeah, know his voice was really good um and again sounded so familiar too um so it's in it's interesting like i would like to know like what the influences like the bands that influenced them and like that and how did they get their name like have you found that out 
No, not yet. I was actually wondering about that myself. I I I, I put a, a little bird in John's ear about this to see so he could go look them up and see if he could find anything. And he had sort of laughed at the name too. He was like, Oh, they sound like they're from Scotland. That sounds sort of like a Scottish euphemism for something, but I don't know. <laughs> well, I mean <laughs> so, if you just take the S away, right? The the, yeah. the letter it's like nuts. Yeah. Yeah, but maybe it's, like, it's, it's just nuts. that kind of cute, clever way of just being like, you know, nuts. Yeah, 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 exactly. I don't know yet, but I will report back when I find out. I might throw you another one from these guys down the line just to give you a taste of what else they sound like. No, that sounds good. Um, and again, that wah-wah, that guitar, that guitar part was really cool. So when you talk was, about was, a lot of other stuff being more like guitar centric like that, that doesn't surprise me, you know, because these yeah. guys are definitely, you know, there's no gimmicky stuff like that. You know, this was an interesting song, but it sounds like these guys can really play. Yeah. yeah, it was cool that they kind of got out of the like the most of the song. You think, okay, this is more like a, a produced song with a lot of electronics driving it. Then they throw in that awesome lead guitar part with the wah that you're talking about. It's like, yeah. oh, yeah. nice, nice little change of pace for the tune. It, it needed that. So, um, for two and a half minutes, they fit a lot in there. I thought it was pretty good, but you're right, it is short. It is short. Yeah. Okay. So this 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 was cool. So because you actually did really well, why don't you take a second? <laughs> okay. Thank you. Um, <laughs> One night. Later. Thank you, Vic Cahuda. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody out there in the into the music world, thanks so much for tuning in. And if you have anything to say or anecdotes you want to drop, the comment fields down below. Like, share, subscribe if you feel so inclined. We do appreciate you. Um, but all that being said, Greg, you're the man. Thank you so much for hosting me today and listening to this song. <laughs> <laughs> and I hope everybody out there has an awesome rest of your day. Take care and be well. See you on the next episode of Into, Into the Music. The music.